Yeah, for us, obviously, great to get uh, when we always talk about as coaches, the, the first one to get of the season is always the hardest. And I'm um, proud of uh, a lot of things tonight. I, I thought our, you know, we, we had some kids step up. We had some uh, turnovers, uh, turnovers uh, because maybe some, some tough lineups out there. But I thought rebounding the basketball was key at times. You know, we, we probably didn't get as many second chances with the offensive glass uh, as we would have liked. But I thought some of the times that we did were huge. You know, I thought Claire's three on, uh, on that possession that she, she had gotten three of them off and, and finally made the third one was big. Uh, I thought the ability for, for Chap and Addy to get some offense, or I'm sorry, to get some defensive rebounds that allowed us to play uh, the zone the way that we did tonight, I, I thought was big. Um, and, and again, I think we kind of held them at bay for the most part. You know, So you're happy with that. And we had to lead the entire game, outscored them every quarter. Um, but I, th I think there's a lot of things that we had to work on. You know, And I, I think there's um, really proud of the fact, obviously, you forced 30 turnovers. That you feel good about that. I thought we did disrupt them and got them uncomfortable. Um, but some of the help defense, some of the drives, staying in front of the basketball, we know that we need to get better at. And uh, But I believe that we will. Talk about the five freshmen and how they contributed to the game and, and Javon, their team scoring for 110 10 points and, and how they helped the team. Yeah, and just aggression. You know, I don't think any of this was the, the moment was too big for them. I think that's the nice thing about starting the season at a place like Virginia Tech and in a tough game in a tough environment. Um, so I think they kind of got some of those wiggles out maybe uh, in the first game. I thought they were huge for us today. Um, but, you know, again, I think they'll all tell you that, you know, coach, coach is going to point out some mistakes and things that they got to get better at. But that's what we told the team after the game. You know, it's good to get a win like that. Proud of, uh, of a lot of things. We know we can get better, but those are all things that are relatively easy fixable right now. I thought it was huge for us. One, you always talk about how you want to defend home court and, and play the way that you want to uh, and start a game the way that you want to. I also thought just from a defensive standpoint, getting a team that is, is on the road uh, a little bit there, you know, in some way, I've been there before. It's like the whole team is freshmen for you. So they do have some young kids, but it's a new system uh, for Tim over there. I think they're going to be really good. It's just you catch them early in the season. And, and that's something that we talked about of early in the game. We talked about not putting them at the free throw line, uh, which I thought we did way too much in the first half, especially the first quarter. Uh, but otherwise, I thought they were uncomfortable and, uh, and got them out of their comfort zone quite a bit today. How has Claire shown in her leadership just being able to go through the game for her? And she just seems to be consistent for you. Consistent, and I think just her aggression. You know, and, and again, obviously you saw that we talked about the possession earlier, but you know, you, you miss two shots, and, and I think both of them she knew right away that she had missed. You know, normally her misses aren't uh, looked like they were going in. I think she knew, we knew that those first two weren't going in, but she she stepped right up into that third one and, and knocked it down. And I think that's the confidence that, that she exudes. I think just the energy that she brings. You know, she made a couple of mistakes, and, and she can take Coach yelling at her too. You know, and I think that's that's something that uh, that shows good leadership, and I think kind of models everything for the younger kids. And that was the goal, you know, and I, and I think we probably got a little bit overzealous in, in the first half with a lot of those 16 free throws were us putting them the line on, on jump shots and mid-range stuff. And some of it was not staying in front of the basketball, but they were all shooting fouls. You know, we had eight, eight fouls in the first half, I think it was, and, and 16 free throws for them. So that was, that was tough. And I thought the second half we were much better. Some of that was in the zone of just contesting, getting the rebound, and getting out and going.